Hello everyone, happy Saturday! It's Doug, back at you with more trivia for the weekend with the Tualatin Public Library. Bringing you two rounds, eight questions each, each round with its own theme. Going to go ahead and read you the questions for both rounds and let you take as much time as you need to come up with the answers before I answer them for you. Round one is about literature. We've got literature-related trivia. Number one, what significant law relating to literary and artistic works was first introduced in 1709? A significant law related to literary and artistic works. Very important. Number two. My dear, I don't give a damn is a quote from which novel? Which novel? Number three. What is the technical name for a 14-lined poem in rhymed iambic pentameter? 14-line poem rhymed iambic pentameter. What is it called? All right, number four. Mark David Chapman shot Beatles legend John Lennon in front of his Manhattan home and later gave this book to police as an explanation for his motive. Which book did Mark David Chapman give the police to explain himself? Number five. Which psychological condition is named after a literary character who refused to grow up? A literary character who refused to grow up. Number six, Robert Galbraith is the pseudonym for which famous author? Robert Galbraith, who is it? Seven, number seven, Reader, I Married Him is the concluding line from which novel? Reader, I Married Him. Which novel has the final words? And number eight, we've got a three-parter. And it's simply, name the three musketeers. What are the three musketeers' names? You got this. Easy peasy. And we've got another wild card round. Yes, general trivia of all different types. Here we go. Number one. What do you call the waiter in a restaurant who has charge of all the wines and their service? Someone who's especially knowledgeable about wine. What, is, what are they called? Number two. Diamonds are made up almost entirely of which element? Diamonds. Which element? Number three. In 1946, The Killers was the final acting role of what actor before they entered politics? 1946 film The Killers featured which eventual politician? Number four. Rainbow Warrior was a ship belonging to which environmental organization? The ship Rainbow Warrior. Who did it belong to? Number five, where would you find the Sea of Tranquility? Where would you find the Sea of Tranquility? And number six, a couple celebrating their crystal wedding anniversary have been married for how many years? How many years is a crystal anniversary? Okay, number seven. What island does the Statue of Liberty stand on? What's the name of the island where the Statue of Liberty is? And number eight, last question of the day. Which ancestor of Noah is also the name of an oversized champagne bottle that holds six liters? An ancestor of Noah, also a huge champagne bottle. If any of you need a lot of champagne, which I wouldn't blame you right now. Okay, going back. Answer in round one, significant law related to literary and artistic work, 1709, copyright. My Dear I Don't Give a Damn, Gone with the Wind by Margaret Mitchell, 1936. And a 14-lined iambic pentameter rhyming is a sonnet. And Mark David Chapman gave the police a copper copy of Catcher in the Rye to explain his motive for killing John Lennon. And the psychological condition named after a literary character who refused to grow up, Peter Pan Syndrome. And Robert Galbraith is the pseudonym of J.K. Rowling. And Reader, I Married Him, the concluding line in Jane Eyre by Charlotte, Charlotte Bronte. And the Three Musketeers, 
Porthos, Athos, and Aramis. Okay, and general trivia. A uh, waiter or other server who is extremely knowledgeable about wine is a sommelier. Diamonds are made almost entirely of carbon. 1946 film The Killers is the final acting role of Ronald Reagan, and the ship Rainbow Warrior belongs to Greenpeace. And the Sea of Tranquility is on the moon. And a crystal wedding anniversary is 15 years. And the Statue of Liberty, it's on Liberty Island. Not very creative. And an ancestor of Noah, also a huge champagne bottle, is Methuselah. So there you have it. Two more rounds of trivia for your wonderful Saturday evening. I will see you next week with more. And in the meantime, stay safe, stay happy, and I will see you soon. Bye-bye.